Hello friends, welcome to the video tutorial of WordPress WooCommerce code system plugin. This plugin provides the functionality to the store owner or the admin to allow the customer to code their products. After that, a customer can send quotation request of the products to the admin. It is very effective to purchase products in bulk. A customer can also communicate with the admin for their queries related to codes. So now we move through the admin panel of this plugin. After successful installation of the plugin, a new tab WooCommerce codes will be available in the admin dashboard. And admin can configure this code system under WooCommerce code and code settings. And there is an option available to enter the number of uh, minimum number of expired dates of codes. So uh, let's say I put a seven days over there. So eight code will be expired after seven days. So now we save changes and all the changes will be saved. After that, uh, admin needs to enable code for a particular products. To enable a code, um, admin can uh, uh, do this with, uh, by editing a currently existing product or by ad adding a new product. So we can uh, move through the currently existing products and by editing the same. So we move through the products here all the products will be listed. So we choose a product uh, like Flying Ninja for this setting on and we enable quote for this product. So we can enable quote under inventory and there is an option available enable quote. So we just need to check this option and uh, update the product. Then uh, this product will be treated as a code product and a customer can uh, send code for this particular product. So now we move through the front end where uh, a customer can code this product. So after login, uh, we move through the shop page where all the products will be listed and uh, this is the product flying ninja which we edited earlier and enable code for this product we click on the product and we came over to the product page uh, here is an option code this product will be available so a customer can uh, easily code this product and provide uh, uh, their quotation for this product for example right now the price of this product is 12 dollar and a customer want to purchase uh, 50 quantity of this product at the price of $8. So he just need to uh, press code this product button and uh, enter quantity 50, enter price per item which is 8 and enter the description description uh, which he want to and it is like a message also which he, which he can send to the admin that is please approve this code and a customer can also provide a uh, file or image uh, along with this code for this he, he just needs to uh, press choose file and he can put a uh, image for example this is in dummy image and submit code now, now code requested successfully and the customer can see his code under my account section under my requested codes this is the code uh, which we uh, requested here now a customer can also able to edit or delete the code these are the codes which are expired after expiry of a code a customer cannot purchase the product on a approved code price so a customer can edit the code by clicking edit button now this is the conversation uh, which is currently not available and all the details a customer can change code price code quantity at any time before approval of the 
admin so now we move through the admin panel where we uh, can see the that how admin will be uh, going to handle the code so admin can access all the codes under WooCommerce codes and all the quotation will be available over there this is the last code which is uh, sent by the a customer any admin can edit this code by click edit button so these are the details which are available to the admin like code price code quantity and status and enter message if admin wants to send any message or any communication to the customer so now we change the status as approved and enter the message to the customer that your code approved and update code so now the status of the code is approved update and the same will be uh, available to the customer as well so now we move through the front end or customer panel under my account admin can find all the codes under my requested code and this is the last code which is approved by the admin once a code approved by the admin a button add to cart will be available over there and by pressing this button a customer can easily add uh, the products into the cart on quoted price or the approved price we just simple uh, need to uh, click add to cart and the product will be added to the cart we can uh, go through the view cart to see all the changes now we can see that uh, the 50 quantity of the product will be added at the price of eight dollar per quantity which is approved by the admin so now a customer can easily place this order at the discounted price or the code price that's all for the wordpress woocommerce code system plugin if you have any query or suggestion regarding the plugin you can mail us at support at webcool.com or you can raise a ticket at webcool.uvdesk.com thanks for watching this video stay tuned for more updates thank you